So today we finish up Romans chapter 6, looking at verses 20 through 23. And Paul uses an interesting word to ask the Romans about their sin. He said, what benefit did you reap from your life of sin? Benefit? You ever thought of sin as a benefit? There is a benefit to sin. We have a little bit of pleasure and then we get a lot of pain that comes with it. But to everything in life there's benefit. If I go and I, I eat a bunch of food, I get fat. If I go and I work out, then I get thinner. If I restrain what I eat, then I get thinner even yet. To sin, there is a benefit, and the benefit is death. But Galatians 6, 8 tells us, hey, while you're on that path of benefiting death, you get to have some corruption on the way. And so there's going to be heartache, and there's going to be trouble, there's going to be trials, there's going to be despair. That's what we reap when we choose a life of sin. So I want you to think about next time, before you, before you delve into sin, think, what's the benefit I'm going to get out of this? And then, but look at the other side. The benefit we get from choosing to be a slave of righteousness is peace of mind, joy, a rewarding life, a fulfilling life. You don't get that in a life of sin. I want you to understand that consequences come from the actions that we do, and sometimes those consequences are incredibly long-term. And so make some promises to yourself that you won't, do the things that are going to get you the long-term consequences of heartache. It's important to make those decisions now before the opportunity arises. That when the opportunity arises, you go, yeah, I've already been here. No, thanks. I'm going to choose something better. Choose the better for your life and choose a way that gives you peace, joy, and happiness. There's a way that leads to death. Matter of fact, in verse 23, Paul says the wages of sin is death. It just simply means the payment. The payment. I go work my job, they put money in my bank account. You go commit sin, there's a reward coming for you. And the same is true for me. Want to read the whole devotional? Go to the link at the bottom of the page. We'll see you tomorrow.